My name is uh, Abu Bakr Maaz, and people call me Bakri, it's easier. I'm a Sudanese artist who was born and raised in Khartoum. I came to Nairobi because of what's happening back there. It's really bad. It was like it was a home because we used to live in it. I used to have it on my back, everywhere, so that's lucky me that I used to have it before the war, then after, that was the only thing I had. So I, I spent a long time making just small sketches, then it, it's all about the war and what's happening, it shows how people live in their houses, it shows what's really happening for kids. I used to do sketches every day. So now it's full of sketches. Like people used to see only my sketch because I make, make some and take pictures so people know my small notebook. So now it's it's in Germany, but it's not for sale. I'm I'm not selling it. We connect it, I think. Me and my small notebook. Hopefully they gonna take care of it till they send it back to me. The small notebook has it, it's not only sketches. I used to write I, everything on it. My thoughts, my projects, my everything. There's phone numbers on it everything. Actually, if you were like in touch with what's happening back there in Sudan, you could see that there is a lot of propaganda happening. It's not what the social media make for people. I would like to ask them, why? When you make people flee out of the, their country, are you, would you like to live alone? No benefit from war. No one gonna win this. So why? Stop it. So I always believe that when you do something honestly, it won't just disappear for nothing. Like, my finger is not strong enough like my hand, isn't it? So, when you're sharing your experience with others, you are not gonna lose anything. You're just gonna make, you're gonna be stronger, like exchanging the knowledge, ex like do collaboration with more artists, makes the community stronger. That's my one and only thing. Let me tell a story about my mom. When she trying to go to visit some friends, she asked me to make some paintings for them, to take them as a gift for them. Every empty wall in the house, it's my responsibility because they just need paintings. My mom used to say something in Arabic. She says, Bakri, Matlemis. Matlemis means like, stop doing it slowly, slowly. Do it fast. Make another one. Finish this. Make another one. Well, I have, I have a lot. I have a lot of plans, but I, I just need time. I just need time. Then I just need to stop worrying about my family back there. I just need to be like focused, relaxed. My last soul exhibition was called Behind the Wheel. It has another meaning. This circle, this universe, this world, it's really going in a circle, but sometimes it comes in a bad 
situations, but it's not going to stay. Nothing lasts for forever. So inshallah, the good thing is coming. Hopefully, we could go back and make Sudan better place.